good day hope you're doing well so we got a interesting news article today from the Sun in the UK extremely rare Star Wars action figure from 1979 sells for world record 90,000 pounds so let's read this article dated July 22nd 2019 a rare Star Wars action figure that never made it to market was sold for a record 90,000 pounds. The 1979 plastic Boba Fett was set to be released alongside The Empire Strikes Back. I guess this is a picture of Boba Fett. Maker Kenner axed it amid concerns over the rocket firing mechanism. They were due to be destroyed, but a hundred were taken home by staff. Darn staff taking stuff home from work. <laughs> it was bought online by a fan in the U.S. Alex Winter, president of the U.S.-based Hakai's Auction, said the toy was pulled from the line after being deemed a possible safety hazard for children, thus making the Bubba Fett figure extremely rare and coveted in the collecting world. Possibly around 100 made it out of the factory and only a handful have ever come to the market. We set the previous record for the same type of Bubba Fett prototype figure last year, so we suspected a world record could be on the cards this time around. Both we and the seller were delighted with the results, which showed the strength of the market. So that was pretty interesting, this, that this plastic Bubba Fett, uh, just they destroyed all of them except about a hundred, because I guess of his rocket firing mechanism and now um, what 40 years later it goes for about 90,000 pounds that's crazy I mean I understand but just wow for this plastic figure I mean there's not even really any color to it it's just plastic mono monotone color anyways <clears throat> uh, would you be interested in buying something like that I I probably wouldn't I, no I know I wouldn't I'm not that much into Star Wars I guess uh, but if you are let me know in the comment section <laughs> uh, please subscribe like and share this video with others, that'd be awesome. Alright, take care and have an awesome day.